Hey, this is Rhonda, back with another little Dollar Tree haul. Um, Sunday evening, and we're having a nice warm day today. It was almost, well, it was 90 something, about 94, 95. And then with the heat index, it took it up into the hundreds. So, but um, thank goodness for air conditioning. That's all I have to say. I don't know how they did it in the old in the olden days or back then, when and where, but I don't know. Down, down here, especially in the south, the humidity is crazy. So, along with the 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 real heat, um, I was amazed at the the strength and the intensity of the actual um, heat hotness of today. Whatever we're gonna, anyways. Got to have a blooper here. I'm going to do it all at once. I'm going to itch my nose, so might as well get it all done at once. Hey, let's do it. Don't mind me, guys. I've had such allergies going on, too. I think with this weather, we've had a lot of high um, allergy pollen. Something is going on right now with, our, with ha what's happening outside. But let's see. I'm going to go ahead and get started here with... I might as well just get the get it over with because I was pretty excited that I found all of these. Okay, now let me get a move so I don't drop them, so you don't have to hear all my bags reeling, going off and crazy. I found the eek. This is the little eek that I was mentioning on my last video, and I do believe I will paint it this color. I'm going to paint it a bright green. That kind of that lime greening so that's gonna be the eek then I went ahead and I found the boo oops I'm sorry upside down boo with an exclamation mark thought that was so cute so I was pretty happy to find these I could only find the two so I'm on the hunt to find two more another boo and another eek so I do believe this one will probably get painted this color or even the black, I'm not sure yet. So, or purple, I don't know. I did buy purple. So, hey, got some colors here that we can pick from, but boo and eek. Then on that same note, I found gather, and I love these. These guys, these are gonna be so pretty. I felt, I think I'm going to stain them and then do like a whitewash look on them. So, I'm gonna, my gather and then I've got thankful and for the money for a dollar these are really large signs I'm not sure I don't have my my measuring but these are nice size signs as you can tell so thankful and then this is my favorite and that's really the one I wanted the most so family because this is the most important family so anyways i did find those they are at the uh, as considered um in the autumn decorations uh for the gather family and thankful and then in the uh, halloween decorations for the boo and the eek so i did pick all of those up i will get busy and i will start painting them and hopefully i'll one day i am doing a wreath i'm getting my stuff together and I will put that on. So, but I like I said, I did pick up the paints. I picked up the green, picked up that purple, and then I picked up this pretty kind of yellow marigold kind of color that I thought was real pretty. So, and that's those are my paints. Let's see anything else in the crowd. Yes, of course, of course, a uh, horse is a course, of course, of course. But anyways, some more ribbon my favorites i do pick up these when i find them like i said those are those are always a good um addition to any type of crafting for sure now especially with the fall and autumns coming in and now so the give thanks and then the little burlap and these are all wired ribbons so and they all the the two they all have nine feet on them actually so even the small one does in, this, in, the, in the Halloween aisle too, I did find some little LED lights. And these are so cute. These are the little ghosts and these are the pumpkins. And I did get them all. These are bats, 
purple bats. Aren't those pretty? And then, let's see. These are spiders, black spiders. I don't know if you can see that or not. The light is kind of shining, but I just can't wait to turn them on and, and get some batteries in there. I do believe I'm going to use those in my wreaths. So, so look for those, hopefully, and at your Dollar Tree. For a dollar, I thought these are too cute. I love these little ghosts. Look at that. That's adorable. So, and then here's the pumpkins. There they are. They're just, oh, the package is so bad. But anyways, yep, there they go. Okay, now I think that was pretty much all for the crafters items that I did pick up. I found some batteries. I did find the D batteries. These, there's three in a pack for a dollar and I didn't think that was too bad. So I did pick up a couple packs of those because we always need D batteries for flashlights or something. And I always seem to always have the wrong size. I don't know if I showed this on the last haul or not, but I did find this in the book aisle. This is Chicken Soup for the Soul and it's the teenager's uh, book and it is uh, stories about liking yourself. And I just love these, like I said before, I love the little chicken soup books. They, they're they nice, they're easy reads, they, they just, they're really cute. So I thought my my teenager granddaughter would enjoy this so and then let's see down the toy aisle i did find some of the harry potter the little harry potter backpack blind bags i was looking for these and i did only pick up two from my grandson because he is a big harry potter fan so i will send that in his little box to them but for his for his birthday so anyways I was happy to find the two and he can use these on they're like a, a keychain type thing and you can hook them to your backpack so really cute and there's how many they're, they're the little wands the magic wands um, let's see there's well I guess I could count there's eight total so but anyways if I find them again I'll pick them up some more because I think those are those are really a cute buy for a dollar. Uh, I did find another one of the of the little fortune cookies. Oops, I'm sorry. Upside down. Don't mind me. Lucky fortune. And these are so cute. These they they are. You open them up, and there's a little fortune in there, and then there's also a little bracelet that usually has like some sort of charm on it. Just just a cute little light, little thing for a little girl. So. But I thought I'd pick that one up since I find them. And I do. I love the blind bags. I do. We don't get a lot of them, but when I do, I try to pick them up. These are the Lock Stars. I'm not sure about them. I haven't really seen them too much. I have been picking them up. So I'm thinking, you know, for the kids going back to school, you know, they'd be kind of cute in their lockers or something. I don't know. Or on their backpack or something. You know, what the heck. Okay, I think that takes care. Oh, let me see. I got to show you this one. I picked up this little wall, it's like a sticker, and it's the Believe in Miracle Time. And then on the back, it says Magic. So this is an actual unicorn body that hooks up to the head. This is the head and the main part. And then it's got the little stars. But I just thought that was so cute, especially anyone that does like any any little girls or young girls that love unicorns for their bedrooms. And these are very nice. You can move these anywhere. And they, like I said before, they do not harm the walls. So I did pick that one up. Okay. Whoops. I found some more masks. Sorry, I'm moving my 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 phone here. I found some more masks. A couple of them. They're two per pack. So. I've been picking them up pretty regularly and been very, very fortunate to find them because we are not spending a lot of money on masks. I'm sorry. I just, I won't do it. So that's me personally. So that's just how I feel. Food wise, I went back, picked up some more of the Act 2. I got three packages in here, the Butter Lovers, and these are good just to have on hand, stock away in the pantry. 
uh, excellent little buy for a dollar, I thought. So I did find some snack pack pudding. And this is the butterscotch. We like these for a little, I do. I like these for a little dessert. If you put a little bit of um, whipped cream on them and chill them, they are perfect for, for, for 100 calories. Well, actually, these are only 90 calories. And for 90 calories plus maybe 10, 15 for the whipped cream, you've got a cute, a nice little dessert that's not going to be a lot of calories or sugars. Um, these are, I enjoy them. They, for me, this is the butterscotch and it's it's four little packs in here so there you go and let's see who doesn't know about those snack packs everybody knows but i did find some more of the peanut butter cookie mix these do not make a lot of cookies so you know a couple of these would probably be good for a family size but anyways i, bought, I picked up three and these are the ones again that take the vegetable oil and the water so there you go. I don't know if it's going to focus in or not, but that's all you need to make these cookies is vegetable, a teaspoon of water and two tablespoons of vegetable oil. So I did pick those up again just to keep in the pantry and keep on hand. So another thing I did get myself was some more scrunchies. I do love the colors, a little pretty purple one with the black so I always love to keep these on hand also for the summer you know my granddaughters me everyone likes to pull their hair up and they are by scrunchie I think it is and let's see oh I went away I went away from the from the food excuse me I dropped the bag and if I leave it down there my male golden doodle thinks it's his so he'll take good care of it for me I'm sure by that I mean taking it out and chewing on it. I did find some of the Chex Mix. I noticed uh, Chris on uh, Widow Mom of Son Mom Widowed Mom of Sons, and she had these on her channel the other day and said the cheddar is very good, so I, I'm gonna try it. And these are the actual full size uh, bags. These are. Uh, 8.75 ounce so I picked up two so we'll give them a quick try for the Chex Mix so, thought that was a good deal let's see I don't know what's wrong with me I'm off my game today don't mind me guys I promise I'm gonna get with the program I did pick up a couple little 2021 calendars for my girls so this one's a cute one I think it's the perfect size for their bedrooms and that this one is the uh, Rain Volcrans. Bulk, I'm not sure. So they're all oh, unicorn type things. <laughs> so, and this one reminds me of Lisa Frank, which it is a Lisa Frank. And my one daughter, granddaughter loves Lisa Frank anything. So I picked those up for her in her room. And then this one is the unicorn one for the one that loves the unicorn so much. But I thought those were really cute for the kids. So, And for, for, for a dollar, who can't buy? I mean, you cannot buy um, calendars anywhere for a dollar. So much less those cute ones. So, And let's see. Go back to the food. I'll pop back there real quick. I did pick up some of the bacon habanero um, it's made by late July and these are very good I did try a few and they are very good they're a little hot for me but I don't eat a lot of hot stuff so but they are good so I picked those up and also I did pick up some more of the cheddar and sour cream the munch rights these are usually my buy I will buy these for for myself to have a little like chip fix or something, but I, I feel they're not the the back. Uh, um, they're not so bad. So I feel that, you know, for a little bite, a few bites of them, I will eat them. So just to get rid of that craving or something that you go by. I did pick up some more. Of course, I love it when I find these. I'm sorry for the bag. The bag is rattling. But I did find the sunflowers. Aren't they pretty? Look at how pretty those are. And only for a dollar, you guys. Isn't that gorgeous? I love them. 
so anyways these are my my these are my flower so if I I use them on most of my fall breeze so fall and, and autumn breeze Thanksgiving so I did pick up three bunches and if I find the colors I need I will buy them especially the yellow this is my favorite of them, of, of them all so but I think that's pretty much all I did pick up um, I'm glad you came by again and hopefully if you enjoy the the sharing of, of Dollar Tree purchases um, subscribe if you feel like it um, I come back every once at least once a week try to throw one in here and see I am I have ordered a few things off of Amazon. I have ordered some coals, so I might start those hauls up maybe eventually because I do like to watch them and I enjoy seeing what everyone is purchasing and, and, and online especially because nowadays it's almost easier to buy it online than it is to actually go to the store. So I did wear this one today, my t-shirt today. It says, <laughs> By His Grace, I had to read it again, but I can't read it backwards, of course. By His Grace, and it's Ephesians 2, 8. And I love this, because by the grace of God go I. And always remember that. Stay kind, be good, and take good care of each other. It's all we can do. Until the next time, God bless you all, and hope to see you soon. Thank you for for watching my show here or my channel tuning in. I appreciate it.